For these questions, you're going to find the products by using the standard algorithm. Remember, an algorithm is just a set of memorized steps that you'll follow and that allow you to solve the problem. If you look at these problems, you'll notice they're a little different than the ones we've been doing. They're two digit by two digit numbers. So the algorithm is going to be different for these types of problems, but there's a little rhyme you can remember to help you remember the steps. It goes up then over, bring down the zero, over then up, add baby add. So let's look at how that can help us solve some problems. On number one, we have 42 times 89. And down here we have the rhyme that'll help us. So we start at the bottom factor in the ones place. And it goes up, then over. So we're going to multiply first going straight up. So nine times two is 18, carry the one. And then we're going to do over. So nine times four is 36 plus one is 37. Okay, so that's the first part, up then over. Okay, the second part says bring down the zero. So what that means is we're going to put a zero in the ones place. And we do that because the next number that we're going to be multiplying is eight. We're gonna use the number eight to multiply. However, the number actually has a value of 80. So if we bring down that zero, anytime we multiply with eight, it's gonna be just like multiplying with 80. So we brought down the zero. The next part says over then up. So we're going to move to the second digit, the one in the tens place, and this time we're gonna multiply over and then we're gonna multiply up. But before we do that, notice how I have these numbers that I carried from the first round. So I'm gonna draw a straight line all the way through there, just so that I don't get confused if I need to carry any more numbers. So starting with the eight, now we're going to go over. So eight times two is 16. So I'm gonna write the six, and I'm gonna carry the one to the tens place. And now I'm gonna go up. 8 times 4 is 32, plus 1 more is 33. Okay, so I've done that, all those steps, and the last step is add, baby, add. So we're just going to add up our two partial products that we made. So that's the answer. Okay, so let's do number 2. It goes up, then over, bring down the 0, over, then up, add baby add. So we'll start right here with the six in the ones place and go up, then over, then bring down the zero. Okay, we're gonna switch numbers now and deal with the tens place. We're gonna go over and then up and then add baby add. So the answer is 726. Let's do number three. So we start right here in the bottom factor in the ones place, and we go up, then over, bring down the zero, and then we switch to the other digit and go over, then up, and then add it all up. So our answer is 2,000. 997. Okay, we'll look at one more. So we're going to start here with the three, and we're going to go up, then over. So up, three times nine is 27. So I'm going to write the seven and carry the two. And then I'm going to go over. So three times seven is 21, plus two is 23. So I've done up and over over, so now bring down the zero. Okay, we're gonna switch numbers and then we're gonna go over then up. But before we do that, we're gonna draw a line through round one's numbers that we carried. So starting with the five, let's go over. So nine times five is 45. I'm gonna carry the four to the tens place. And I'm going to go up. So 35 plus four more is 39. And then I just need to add them up, add baby add. So the answer is 4,187.
So if you can remember this rhyme, it'll help you solve some two-digit by two-digit multiplication problems. If you need more help, you can come back and re-watch the video. Good luck!